Nityananda 1008 participants are enjoying a variety of Ayurvedic servings throughout each day from Mahadeva's kitchen. Nityanandoham 1008 participants began the day with Nitya Puja, Nitya Kirtans, and Nitya Satsang today. Between sessions, Nityanandoham participants enjoyed their meal together and an opportunity to share some of their learnings together. Swamiji's blessings, Nityananda Dhyanapitam, Puttavai Adinam, held a medical camp for nearby villages, including school children who took part in receiving medicines distributed freely for the needy. One participant shares her experience of the Third Eye Awakening at Nityanandoham 1008. Nityanandam, I'm Sumitra Devi from Malaysia. See, there's a reason for this, there's a reason for Swami to keep asking you to read every day and it's just nothing but then getting yourself to next level and above. I had this very strong, you know, you won't be able to, there is no word in the dictionary to say that what happened exactly at that moment, but let me share, it was a very strong kind of energy that came all the way within me that said, do not live this. You do not want to have this kind of cognition forever in your life. Help yourself. And I said, yes, this is nothing but Mahadeva himself. It is not at all Sumitra Devi who is going to read. It is his glory. He is going to read it. And that's the moment when I closed my eyes and I saw 108. And I had the doubt. See, the self-doubt was so vividly shown within me. And I dropped that at the feet of Mahadeva, at Swamiji. It is so beautiful. That, that experience just like flowered and just started like you no know, you know expand and expand even now i can feel what is happening while i'm sharing to you that that that, that churning within is so beautiful like i'm feeling a nectar of amrita itself i can feel over here the taste of it thank you so much for listening for giving this opportunity to share this beautiful heavenly experience with